Hey everyone, um, I just wanted to take an opportunity to show you my latest product, Roost. Um, Roost is a tool to help you grow your Twitter following and kind of build up engagement on your Twitter account so it can grow naturally, uh, but it's a tool to help you get a boost and then potentially continue to grow your accounts. Um, so let's go ahead and take a look. I'll log into my account. This is my Roost dashboard for one of my uh, newer Twitter accounts. Uh, it's a account for the TV show The Office. It's a fan account. Um, <clears throat> I've been using Roost exclusively to grow this account, and over the past couple weeks, I've got it up to over 700 followers. Uh, and you can see it's growing by uh, 30 to, uh, I'd say, 10 to 30 followers a day, basically. Um, and like I said, I've used Roost for this exclusively, so I wanted to go over some of the Roost features uh, to explain how it works. Um, the strategy is you are going to follow accounts that on Twitter that are similar, <clears throat> uh, that follow accounts similar to the one you're trying to build. Uh, so the way that I found the accounts that I'm following is by using the keyword search tool on Roost. So my account my Twitter account is about the office I'm posting office quotes and stuff like that so I'm going to type in the office and the goal here is to find Twitter accounts that have large followings of, of people who like the office so I'm gonna search for the office and Roost gives me a few awesome Twitter accounts um, this is another office uh, fan Twitter account with 25,000 followers. Here's the official office account with a uh, half million. Uh, Rain Wilson, he's one of the actors on The Office. He's got four million followers. Uh, and these are actors as well. So if I follow any of the, if I follow the followers of these people, uh, those people are likely to follow me back because obviously like they like The Office. Um, so, so the idea is that I'll get a certain percent of those people follow me back and then they'll engage with my content uh, retweet my tweets and then I'll get more followers from them as well so the way that we do that <clears throat> is that we use the copy followers feature and this is I follow Steve Carell's account um, and the office are my two main ones that I'm using right now so if we click on this <clears throat> it's gonna bring up uh, people who follow Steve Carell. So all I have to do is click this button and I am following these people with my on the office Twitter account. And I can follow up to 300 people a day. Uh, that's to say within Twitter's limitations and uh, stay out of the spammy area. So I can follow 300 people a day if 10% of those people follow me back, then I'm getting 30 new followers a day. And as I mentioned, I am getting roughly 30 followers a day. So about 10% are following me back, if not more, uh, based on the engagement on my posts. Um, so I'll go ahead and show you actually my, my Twitter account. Uh, this is the uh, account on Twitter. Um, <clears throat> I'm using FB traffic to post content to it automatically. And you can see people are engaging with the with the content. Like, not only am I getting my follower count up, but they're also actually engaging with the content that I'm posting. Um, this is actually my fan my fan site for the office. So I'm trying to get people there to uh, check out the content and hopefully click ads. Um, so anyway, yeah, let's go back. Now obviously not everyone that I follow is going to follow me back and over the course of time <clears throat> I'm going to get unfollowers and stuff like that. Um, but Roost has you covered there too. So we keep track of your account to see who unfollows you, who never follows you back to begin with, and then the accounts that you do have um, that you're following that go inactive, um, people who quit posting on Twitter, uh, you can go in and unfollow those people too because they're just uh, taking up space on your your limited resources for following people. So let's take a look at my unfollowers. Um, <clears throat> these people all 
unfollowed my account. So more than likely, I'm going to want to unfollow them. Uh, this person at one point did follow my, uh, or I followed this person, so I'll follow them. And then I didn't actually follow these people. They uh, followed me um, and then unfollowed me, so I'm going to blacklist them so I don't follow them again. And then your non-followers are the people who you follow who don't follow you back. Uh, and that is, we give them a, a week to follow us back. If they don't follow us back within a week, then they show up on this list. So I can also go through and unfollow these people. And Roost limits you to uh, unfollowing 1,000 people a day, and, follow, and like I said, following 300. And I mentioned the inactive followers. Um, these are just people who are no longer super active on Twitter anymore. They're not tweeting and stuff like that. So obviously they're not gonna be engaging with your content. Um, so I can go in and um, unfollow them as well if I want. I don't know why that's taking a minute to load, but um, under the follow section, you can see your fans. Those are the people that follow you that you don't follow back. You can go in and follow your, your fans. Uh, your new followers, you can go see who, who recently followed you. Uh, we use the copy followers tool, the keywords tool, and then suggestions are just people that Twitter recommends that you uh, follow. You can manage uh, an unlimited amount of accounts currently with Roost, so you can connect all your Twitter accounts and uh, we'll keep track of, of all your followers, your own followers, and, and help you grow those accounts. Um, so let me know if you have any questions. Uh, um, I'm going to be doing a follow-up soon with, with more of the features that we've been adding to Roost, uh, but I thought it'd be cool just to go over uh, a little bit of what we've been building, and um, you can subscribe and try out Roost yourself. Uh, it's just roost.com. I'll have the link in the in the description. Um, but yeah, comment, let me know if you have any questions, but uh, good luck.